Hello everyone, welcome back. Today I'm on Dragon. Now I've looked at an option where you can import specific words depending on what academic degree you're doing. For example, you might be doing a medical degree or bioscience. So Dragon's got an option where you can import specific words within the vocabulary and that way when you dictate them it's more likely to pick them up because they already exist and you can train a few and it doesn't pick up. It's really easy to do. What I do on my YouTube channel is I leave, a, I leave a couple of lists that I found online for you there. One for biomedical and the other one I think is bioscience. So download them free and do what I'm about to do. So the first thing we need to do, first thing is just download the two files that I've left on my YouTube channel. And they'll look like this. Biotechnology and biology and word lists for medical terms. So I'll double tap the first one. You notice it's in a text document, not a word document. And all the words I have to paste in and you can see a scroll down. We've probably got thousands in there. If I go to the next one underneath, medical terms again, there's thousands. I think there's 76,000. So I only do this if you're doing a specific degree though, but you could do this. You could find maybe law words from different websites, just copying individual words and add them. So what we do is come up to Dragon at the top and select vocabulary. Don't worry about learning from specific documents, that's actually a word document. So if you've done an essay, an assignment, it will analyse it, adapt to your writing style and pull out any words it doesn't already exist in a vocabulary. But if you want specific words, select this option here, import list of words or phrases. This window will now open. You've got an option in the middle where you can preview the list of unknown words. So what Dragon does, it only adds to the vocabulary what doesn't already exist because it's a waste of time otherwise, and they're duplicates. So it will tell you a preview the list of unknown words. But select next, I'm going to leave that unticked. We need to find the document. It's in my download folder. So add file and then AR. You notice they are a text document. So I've, I've already done this, so I'm going to open, do the first one and click next. And then you can see the bump is going to start working away. And it's going to start adding those words to my vocabulary. Now, the other one's 76,000. It could take up to 20 minutes to half hour. So bear that in mind. I'm going to click next. And there you go. It's added 1,981 words. Click finish. And it's as simple as that to do. And then try it out in a document. And it should start picking up those words a lot better. Thanks for watching.